Hey everybody, welcome back. Alright, so we have learned Barrier now. Alright, we're going to move this to number 5, and then we're going to start working on Barricade. No, we can't do that yet because we need expansion from the regular skills menu. Uh, okay. Well, that's going to... I guess we're just going to have to wait. We're just going to have to wait. I don't want to start another spell and then have us have to switch it. We're waiting for dual wielding to finish being learned, and it doesn't have that much further to go, so then we could work on expansion. Uh, alright. So, one thing I've learned from the comments to previous videos is that even though throw is not that powerful of a spell, if you throw stuff at heavily armored enemies, the impact of whatever you throw at them ignores their armor. So it may not do a ton of damage, but it's not mitigated by armor, so that's something good to know. Also, apparently empowering your spells like these two right now that have the uh, purple circle uh, makes them somehow more efficient, I guess, and you can get up to four of these, I guess, where you can actually empower them, but it depends on your level, like how much you've leveled up. Um... So, can I empower strikes? I can't empower strikes for some reason. You probably have to work your way up. No, okay, so anyway. Alright, take a quick glance around here. And look at this Curus right here. Um, Compared to the one that we have, ours is extremely well made, so obviously, if this is not as good, we'll give it to Darren. That's the way to do it. And then up here, some really nice light band braces. We'll take those. Darren already has some. Alright, let's wait for Darren to catch up. Taking forever, as usual. So, there's another skeleton over here. Let's get ready. Oh, I missed. That was a solid hit there. Good parry. Took some red damage there from his axe. Now we're not having much luck with that blast, are we? There we go. Alright, he is dead. Now that was a lot more trouble than I was expecting. Alright, we're going back up now to the third floor, and we're switching back to our one-handed sword here, because we're not going to be dealing with skeletons for the most part. Alright. What is taking you so long, Darren? Okay. Guess I hit him with the flat part of the blade there. There we go, that's a little more like it. Let's try to stab this guy in the face here. <laughs> That'll do. Right in the forehead. I've really been slacking on my face stabs. I gotta prioritize them a little more. Come on. I oh, just missed on that one. Whoops. <laughs> I didn't realize Darren was going to be in the way of my backswing on that slash. Whoops. By the way, how are you doing, Darren? I've been better, but nothing serious. All right. Just 
Try another face stab here. Uh, moved out of the way. Let's try it again. Yeah, got him in right in the armpit or something. Yeah, we're gonna have to work on that. But for now, we're going to get our Sea in the Dark helmet by double clicking that protruding stone. And there it is, looking quite nice. So we're going to put that on, and this down to Darren. And switch to our Great Axe for a little bit. As much as I enjoy face stabbing zombies. Alright, just gonna fall down the stairs real quick, don't mind me. Right, let's look around here. Nothing we can use there. People have been telling me to check the bottles more carefully, that something will say something about there being an elixir in the bottle, if certain bottles, something new, or at least that's how I understand it. But every time I check, it's not that. Alright, is there anything over here? I don't know, but we just learned dual wield, so now we need to work on expansion. So that now we're learning that. And because we can see in the dark, we could... We could do this. Let's dual wield. A one-handed sword and then a war hammer, so we can do all kinds of damage here. That seems like a good idea. All right. Just trying to check any bottle that seems different looking than ones I've run into before, but still no luck. Right. You can move those stones, but I don't think there's anything there. You would think that this would be the place to find something in terms of this elixir thing, but it does not appear to be in the stars for us. All right. Okay, on we go. My goodness, look at those cloth leggings, yeah, yeah, and mine down to Darren. And what do we have here? A two-handed warhammer. Could be useful. We'd probably have to improve it. Okay. Yeah, nothing special here. Okay. Bathroom.
decent little combo there. Uh, let's see. Can we get through here right now? We can. Never remember if that door is locked or not. What am I hearing down here? Hmm. Guess it was on the other side of that door. We'll find out what's going on in a bit. Oh, look at that, a full salve. That is quite nice. Alright, so I suppose there could be someone in this room. I guess not. Alright, there's an upgrade sphere. Also, this light brigandine is not bad. Uh, you know what? I think we're good with the curuses we have. Alright. Whoa! Whoa! That's creepy, they're just sitting there watching us the whole time while we were going through the room. Alright, that's what we heard over there, that fight to the left. Is that the Proctor? Yep. Still on her feet. Got a good stab there, let's try this again. There we go. Okay, so this heavy male shirt, I want that because I'm wearing a vest. Yeah, alright, so the Proctor Sword. Uh, you know, we could upgrade the Proctor Sword. That's probably what I want to do. So here is what we'll do. Let's see what we can get out of this here. Now it's in flawless condition. So, if we compare it now, our original sword still has more balance and more thrust. And that just ends up having more slash. It's got more impact, though, which is nice. Uh, yeah, we'll switch to it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um, let me take a look here. If Darren would kindly get out of my way, that would be great. Trying to get this body out of the way. Of course, it's not working. Trying to get this over here, but as usual, Darren is making it difficult. All right, there. Go away, Darren. And in fact, wait here. Let's try to get a face stab. Oh man, how did that miss? There we go. Whoops. Yeah, okay. Alright, there's a map of the third floor. Alright, some old parchment and the key to the closet with the executioner's sword in it. come from that was interesting
Okay, so anyone over here? Counters, now we're good on counters currently. Bill hook over there. Let's use this key. Toss it. And there is the Executioner's Sword. I'm gonna give this to Darren as a secondary, actually. And we're good on helmets for now, and the Van Braces. All right, let's see. Bardish, and eh, not really feeling it. There's another Warhammer. Some Bill Hooks. And a dude just standing there. That wasn't good. And I couldn't swing because Darren was in the way. Whoa, <laughs> I, I swear to you that was not on purpose. I swear to you that was not on purpose, even though I had just complained about Darren. I know it seems suspicious, but he's still alive. He's still alive, it's no big deal. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about that. Oh, I forgot that this leads over here. Okay, I didn't even notice that but when we were there a second ago. Well, I'm glad Darren is still alive. Okay, long sword, short sword, long knife, and some. No, thank you. How far along are we with, uh, not very long, with expansion? That's unfortunate. There's so much, so much time here. I suppose we could just be learning Torrent. I mean, might as well be learning something. I thought expansion, I thought we could learn it a bit more quickly, but it just, it doesn't seem to be the case. Well, this is not a good idea. Okay, you're in uh, the cobbler's shop, apparently. You know what, I'll take that coat instead of my tunic, why not? Uh, there's a actually a really nice arming cap, I'll take that of course, and give Darren the old one. And these light shoes are not bad. I'm going to take those instead of those. So when I do switch to Greaves, we'll have those ready to go. Whoops. All right. All right, male leggings. I'm going to put those on over my cloth leggings. Doesn't appear to be anything we need there. Uh, just looking around in there real quick. You know what? Let's go 
ahead and give this coat to uh, Darren. All right, so that's going to be it for this episode, everybody. Thank you very much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe if you would like to, and I will see you all next time.